Good morning. I'm um, out with the John 316 UK today. Well, he's about somewhere. It's about somewhere park at the minute. I wanted John's permissions. Big place. Uh, can you hear him? He's here. <laughs> Morning. Hello. <laughs> yeah, so we come out on the uh, John's permission. Uh, we just walk from way over there down there. John's just a bit earlier. After seeing this bit of formation in the ground here, I thought, well, I'll give it a It is windy today, so hopefully the wind protector is definitely going to be working because it's been checked and it's ace. Uh, walked along, virtually on the top, this. But I don't think it's a button. And then again, I'm no doubtly wrong. It's about the same size as a 20 pence piece. Uh, not sure. Show it, John. See what he says. As you see, the little fluttery bits. We need a trim on them. But we'll show you how actually windy it is. Uh, but you can't hear any wind noise. So it's either wind noise or little fluttery bits. So we'll go for fluttery bits today. So move along. Oh, up and down, up and down. 2-2 two, two round after 2-2 two, two round. I can show them if you want. But they all look the same. There you go. Got about six of them just on this bank side. A uh, big piece of aluminium which is going to be the other bag. And uh, this is my first coin, unless I have other ones of coin. Like that all there. Uh, it looks like a Victoria Bunhead. It is. Pretty worn that one. Right under the trees though. So. I know the leaf litter and stuff attacks the coin with the uh, acidity in the leaves as they rot away. I was told, I don't know how true that is, it looks like, it looks like it's, it's, uh, it's right. It's clean up, not too bad though, see who it is. Little Vicky Bun. I can't get a date the other side's a bit uh, even there. Alright, see what else we can find. I'm going to doom this one. The uh, reason I'm going to live dig this is because the ground's slightly different, so it's like a sandy part there. Uh, and you know it's in there. Yeah. We don't, I don't know where it is yet. What the hell is that? Mm. One of them. I have no idea, it looks like a little teeny telephone. That's weird. That's some sort of half a buckle or... I don't really know. Yeah, my hand's nice and dirty, aren't for my breakfast? Anyway, whatever that is. I'm getting plagued with these today. I think every other old's one of these, so... I'll show you that, and that's one going probably 80%. It's actually seen rain. I say it was getting rain today. I've got a non-waterproof coat on as well, but I not about that. Anyway, I uh, just found a... We can guess it's a Vicky half penny. I'm not really sure. Very smooth. And onwards. Well, this is reading a 47 on um, GM Power. So you see that there. So I just flipped it straight out using my super shovel. I think he was giving me a coin somewhere, and there it is. I think it's a coin, maybe a button. Oh, it's a button. I don't mind a button. <laughs> no comments, yeah. press forward just a little bit more. Tick chill. <laughs> He's a good boy! <laughs> well, after the incident with the cows, which were right down there, right, well, bulls, right, frisky individuals. I was a bit worried at one point. I'm fond of these for ages, and I'm pretty sure, but it might not be. It's the end of a chimney sweep brush, but there's no insert. Normally you get a piece of wood or something, unless it's the very end of one, I don't know. But it doesn't look brass either, which is weird. Right in the middle, right underneath this tree. Very strange. I'll investigate a bit more around here, see what I can come up with. At the moment, it's a very, very quiet day today. We're more interested in what's going on with them cows, I think, bulls, whatever they are. Mm, maybe not. Oh, I'm still lurking around underneath that, that tree. Yeah, it looks like the end of a cane, I think. 
Or something else. Let's look at the wood in it. So that it's something to do with something. Don't know what. So I just want to show you that sky. Yeah. Don't know down there. Can't zoom in. I've decided to head back towards the cows again. Yeah, I just found this. Got a rolled lead. So I'm going to roll it, see if it says anything inside, but I doubt it. Oh, I can't do one hand, don't I? I'll back to you in a second. Yeah, nothing went inside. Being followed by bulls again. I thought I'd just fell on it, just in case anything, anything good happens. <laughs> we veered if you blow raspberries at him. <laughs> They're thinking about it. Go and run the last bit. <laughs> See if it goes. Right, John's just had a uh, phone call off uh, a landowner. Apparently, they had a bonfire over the weekend, and somebody's lost a rose gold wedding ring. So we deplo deployed the troops, me and John. So we we can go have a look for it. So if there's no video after this, we didn't find it, <laughs> basically. Uh, so maybe long. That's that doing it. John just uh, dropped me off to have a quick look at there. These standing stones. Look at all these. Really do it justice on this camera, but weird. Really cool, isn't it? That big piece of rose quartz up here. Big piece of rose quartz. Looks like somebody's been there. Uh, Doing something or other. Probably been gaffing it off. Hey! I'll get off of you. Oh, yes. Right, we're heading back. Uh, did find that ring. Uh, didn't find it. Found a bullhead. No, we found a bullhead, a fake one. <laughs> found a fake bullhead. But uh, there's some llamas and stuff down here. Lying there, look at top of the Lying on top of the gorilla. Harambi! That's it. And I think there's another llama there. So you get, oh, there's a panda there, you don't often see them in Staffordshire. Yeah, it's in a windmill. Yeah, so uh, thanks for watching. If you want to watch, you can see it's pretty boring, isn't it? But uh, yeah, yeah, shit today. That's yeah, weird. So you go for being detected. <laughs>
mine was a bit lemony for some reason. Not the hell I've been chopping on that chopping board. So um, I've got one of these. It's one of them. Very disappointing thing. Now, moving on. Well, this was a 55, 56 signal. Thought it was either a cord or something really bad. And it's something you rub around your shithole. So, Germaloids cream. Local anaesthetic soothes itching, pain relief and shrinks piles. Wait, it's, move your finger. Oh, okay. For the rectum only. For the rectum only, apparently. So, don't get rubbing it in your eye. Uh, only your brown one. Yeah. It's not yours, is it? No, not yours. Not yours? Well, this? Right out here. Right the way out here. And somebody's been on a right itchy shithole. <laughs> Weird. Weird. Oof. Anyway, moving on. Well, we've decided it's enough's enough. We haven't found anything, have we, today? Nah. Nothing. I haven't even found God today. You can say I found that, which is just the worst coin you could ever... But it's a coin, but it's probably the worst one I've ever found. You found a, what, three-inch brass screw? Yeah, chuck there. Some other little bits, a little anchor. Because I'm a anchor. Squashed... Uh... I'm not going to even say that's a pistol ball, you know. It is? Yeah. Squashed one? No, it's not. Turns yeah. right ways. No, it's not. No, you're not having that today. Okay. No, you're not allowed to know that today. Okay. Yeah. Two buttons and then I found one on the surface. Well, three. There's a Tudor little, one. A little Tudor button and... There's the a phallus ring. Phallus... Follicle ring. You found... I found out I don't have a curry before you come back with detecting. Well, it's a bit. got bog roll. And you got none? <sighs> well, uh, like I say, I've had new wellies, so I'll show you them later on. They're fluffy as well, aren't they? Yeah, they do have fluffy. My tags fell off. Uh, but uh, somebody crossed me and threw a bottle of piss all over me this morning, which is interesting. I said my wellies were waterproof, but my trousers weren't, so we uh, wrecked it, didn't we? Yeah. We're out today with Fubar, John316 UK, and Fubar Junior with Jordos. Um, very cold this morning, it's a 6 degrees at half past 8 in the morning. Uh, my first find is disappeared. So it was only a button anyway, but it's somewhere in there. Is it all it's gone? Right. No. That was happening seed. Just a little shitty button. Well, moving on. No, oh, we just had a bit of breakfast. Could be freezing. Uh, just found that. George something or other. Bloody cold today. I think I'm making it. I think it's six degrees at the minute. So pretty cold. Jordo has got a new shovel. Good to see of uh, these guys. I think it started snowing. To be honest, cold. Bonsoir. Well, I've never found one of these before, and we've say football has just found one, and I've just found. I just found one as well. Nintendo cartridge. Uh, they read in a. 51 uh, for Nintendo cartridges. So we uh, he's got one but he's got a sticker on it, so we don't know what that what that one is. Hey? Mine mine's a good one. I like mine. I've just got this. It's uh, Elizabeth II. Uh, 1950 61. Oh and a massive horseshoe. Absolutely huge bugger. So we uh, you never know, see what happens. Oh, we, we've moved fields again. There's a few bits of lead and stuff at the minute. Uh, nice down there. Little the best find of the day, at the minute, was uh, my uh, Nintendo cartridge, uh, cartridge the uh, Crash, uh, Crash Nitro Racing. So what I'm going to do, I may buy a Game Boy Advance and see if it still works. You never know. Well, I started to dig this out. I wasn't going to film it because I wouldn't think it. I thought it was just going to be a 2-2. Two -two. I was reading a 52 on uh, Program 2 using 11 kilobits or megabits, whatever it is. At the minute I've got that. With a chain or something going on. Not sure what it is just yet. Probably a bog chain there, my look. So that's a little bit of... Often fine bits of chain. Well, that's one, yeah. Not gold or anything. It's probably just a, like I say, chain off a sink. 
possibly. Well, George just found a bit of a signal there. It's the biggest piece of lead ever found. Well, you've got at least nearly six foot, nearly six foot of lead there. Well, I'm six foot one. Yeah. So it's at least five nine. Easily. Fantastic. It's about ten kilos, eh? Get that in the pouch. Well, this new permission I've got is absolutely massive. Just say shout out to everybody that comes with me, to be honest. Uh, just found a can of Carlsberg. I don't know. There you go. You can see. It's not that big a bottle well, you can see. It, Come on. Can of kind of Carlsberg. Carly, whatever it is. And that's right next to the pond here, so I'm getting guess this is going to be a fishing weight probably. Let's have a look. Surprised if it's anything other than a fishing weight. Oh no. Some of that. Well, this is really an 86. So, it's somewhere there. Not sure what it is. Ooh, what's that? I don't know. We'll be back off a watch, I think. Not sure what that is. No idea. All sprass or something, possibly. Hmm, don't know. Shit, too far. Yeah. Well, I've just found a coin. You found a knob, didn't you? I found a knob. Uh, don't know what that is, it's just a. Coin? Just a coin. It's an unusual shape, though, that. That's more coin shape than what I found. It is, isn't it? Naffle? Mm. So I've got you in the Not food. sausage. Well, that many. Not that. Yeah, we've had, we've had one of them sort of days today. Once. So, I think it's not been again, that good, has it? No, it's not been good today. Better not been kind to us. So, uh, we're. Oh, well, I have. <laughs> <laughs> better than a Herefordshire dick. Could have been. Yeah? Yeah, a lot better, a lot more. Yeah? Twice as good. Yeah. It's been raining half the No, we thought it was getting rain, but it didn't. It's just very cold. Very, very cold. Got a pocket full of scrap. You got one of them. Oh yeah, from the Court of All Dimages. One of them. Well, that's weird. Transportation token. It's like a National Chinese coin. transport. He's yeah. got. That. That's not from here. I don't know. Oh, that's nice. That uh, anchor. You that anchor. Ed Archie. That isn't. No, that's not. That isn't. That is. That isn't. Mm -hmm. One of them beard wings, but we're not going to do it in this video. Are we? Mm, it's right. just dead, isn't it? It's dead. It's dead. <laughs> Oh, and one of them? It's a dodo. -do. Got the uh, hypothermia, and the frostbite on my fingers. Big piece of lead. Yeah. Nice. Oh, if, you, if you want, yeah. Uh, I've just got a bag full of rubbish. I haven't got much roundiness. Well, what's winder? No, no, that's nice, nice. Mm, yeah. A couple of cartridges, okay. just in <laughs> case we get bored. Yeah. Better the shotgun cartridges. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you may expect to find them. I'm bits and bobs of the uh, food bar. And that's it. And that's it, and I've just got some bits in here. Just a load of crap. Which aren't really worth looking at. <laughs> but so, at least we didn't get them off eBay. Exactly. So it's real detecting. Look, I've got a silver. Well, there we go. Oh, oh you've got silver. silver. Yeah, silver. silver. Get the silver. Uh, I've got about 200 weights of silver foil. <laughs> and a nice little silver. Bit clean go. that is, isn't it? It's clean. Yeah, right? eBay. Yeah. eBay. Oh, it's fine, though. Some yeah. people up north do buy from eBay, but we don't know him. No. We were just told that. Anyway, moving along. Well, thanks for thanks for subscribing and viewing and all that stuff. Cheers, and Harry. if you're not a subscriber, I detect. 